Well, we're going to start. We haven't done anything for a while because of obviously the problems. We're here at beautiful Quintero Golf Course. Uh, they're nice enough to let us use our teaching facility. And I want to talk a little bit about the basic premise of playing golf, okay? That I don't think anyone will argue with. When you play golf, you have basically two lines. You have your target line where the ball sits on, and then you have your strike line, okay? Target line, strike line. So when you are trying to hit a golf ball, you're trying to hit this line and make that go straight, okay? That's it. If you're chipping, it's slow speed. If you're hitting at 160 yards, it's high speed. So you have to be able to, as I turn this around, I have people stand on it, wait, what, forward, like a chip or a pitch, and then I have them practice, okay, seeing how many times they can hit that plastic with the divot in front of the plastic. So your hands start in front and then you smash into that plastic. And basically if your hands do not, if that feels odd to your hands, in theory the conversation about golf is over. You can't do that. So I have people and I'll train them, I'll get them stand, I'll grab their hands and I'll smash plastic, smash plastic and they always will say that's that's pretty odd for me. Well, we have to make that feel natural. Once your hands get intelligent and smart enough to find that plastic, golf gets a lot easier. Remember, if it sounds complicated, it's wrong. 